Stanford University. Let's hope his tactics are going to work against NCCU. And right now in the arena, we are introducing the official referees. And the lights out, which you know it means it's time to in introduce the starting five for both teams. First up, Radford University. First up is number two, Waters Trenton Darnell. Number two, Kyle's Kitten Critters. Number 10, Chandler Andrew Turner. Number 13, Trevor Robert Grove. Number 21, Dontre Dominique Pierce. That is the starting five for Radford University. And next up from Chinese Taipei National Chang'e University, NCCU. First, let's enjoy a great basketball game at WBS. And here we go with the tip-off. First ball goes to NCCU. Shea passing it to Z. Z now passing it going in. And there goes the first shot and a miss. Radford University with the ball now. And we get a first foul. Because of the high differences, I think the uh, NCCU faced a little bit of differences from yesterday to today. Uh, all the guys uh, from Radford University are tall. Mm, very true, very true. There goes the play now. Go with the ball. Going to Giles. Giles driving in, takes a shot, and he makes it. That was very smooth. And the first point goes to Radford University. Now for the NCCU. Seen having the ball. That's the Ben. And a nice cut by Radford. Oh, that was a great ball move, man. Sadly a miss. And out of bounds. Uh, one of the best strengths that Radford University has is a uh, you know rebounding game, and they are trying to have more positions. So attack into the rim, kick it out. That was a great offense by Radford University. And uh, here we go now, number seven I with the ball. Definitely trying to go after the first point. Hey, passes it to Seen. Been looking for an open, pass it to number seven. And there's a first shot by, oh, good, good, good shot. by Bay. It was good that he made the first shot, so uh, that's gonna make the Raffle University very difficult game, so it's a good start for them. No doubt on it, and there goes Walters. Passing it to Turner, Turner with the shot. And a miss. Try to go with a three-point animus now for NCCU. Z passing it to Singh. Singh goes himself. Back and loop. Oh, and a cut. Walter's going in, passes it. And passes to number 10, and there it goes by Turner. Since they have a size and they can attack quick, you know, NCCU uh, doesn't want to turn the ball over. Very true, very true. And a three-pointer by number 23. Sadly, a miss. Now again for the offense by Radford. Going to number 10, Turner. Turner going in. Goes for the shot, and he makes it. So far, the pace is going towards Radford, isn't it, Hamanaka-san? Yes, absolutely. Uh, they secure the defensive rebound, one and done, and then they try to push the ball and then stri stretch the floor. So, uh, Radford has been doing great so far. And a three-pointer. Yeah. 
since uh, NCCU is undersized, that three-point make or not is going to be a huge key for them to win the game. That's true. Now there was a foul by Radford University by number 21, Pierce. We got some change with the players. Number five, Harris, is in now. One of the players that we, we definitely picked up, had a great game yesterday. It's going to be a, a great battle around the rim, so I'm That's very right. excited to see. Against Harrison Bay. Yes. Both gave each other big eye contact. <laughs> Rafford also had one more substitution, and that was number 11, Burns. And here we go, Rafford ball. Passing it to Burns. You can feel the tension between Harrison Bay. Yep. There goes Harris. And then the Turner. Turner going himself. A two pointer. And a miss. Radford ball. And Bay doesn't seem to be happy with that call by the referee. Well, looking at the replay, you can kind of tell Mbay was the last person to touch in the ball. Both very aggressive on the ball. Pass to Giles. Giles going himself. Oh, and a foul. So both of the teams have got into the huddle and then make sure they'll be on the same page for an exposition, offense and defense. That's good to see. Definitely. Teamwork is the key for this game. First shot makes. Second shot going now. And a miss. NCC ball, driving in, there he goes, and a shot, and a miss. A great crash between two players. He goes with a shot. Oh, Harris going for the ball. Seems at bay with a crash, another foul. NCCU has been really, really struggling to grab the defensive rebound every single time. Raffle University crashing over board, taking advantage. True, true. And now it's a five point lead by Radford University, seven to two, NCCU two. Still got six minutes and 15 seconds and already have 14 fouls for NCCU. A good shot by Harris. There will be some of the uh, regulation differences uh, from FIBA rule and NCAA. Uh, they cannot sub in, the, you know, uh, first and second free throw shot. Very true, and it's right after when they call it. Oh, Harris tries to go get it, but NCCU gets it. I running in. Pass to the man. Oh, yeah! And that's what we will we all like to see. Not just yesterday, but even for today, Mbay gives us a nice little, little slam dunk. Yep. Hopefully this gives them energy on the defensive end. True that, true that. Got to heat up the team, even on the D. Great ball Not pressure. What a foul. Foul by number two, Tim Chisu. My apologies on the name, folks. For number three is Kenyon Giles, not Giles. Makes the first shot. Going for the second shot now for Giles. What a key making those shots. And there you have it. Can you 
Now six point lead for Radford University, 10-4. Got to find that sweet spot to make those shots for NCCU. Oh, and a nice pass by Bay. And a great shot by Sheen. There was some miscommunication between Gargar on Raffle University, and they find it really well on offensive end. Harris now going in, and nice shot by Harris as well. NCCU now. I going himself. Goes for the shot. Oh! And there goes a the foul. Good play by number seven, I Cheyu. That was a foul by number three, Giles. You can tell that NCCU is having that pressure with the height difference. Absolutely, but attacking the paint, make the defense shrink and be ready to kick it out for the open three, that's gonna be another key for them. And getting a free throw is a huge key for them as well, so that was a great attack. Both shots in, great job, IHAU number seven. And they have been playing matchup slash zone type of stuff. Now the rebounding is going to be a huge key that has been killing them so far. So ball pressure is great, but they got to figure out how to grab a defensive rebounds. Very true. And a nice shot by number 13, Row now. Now it's NCCU's turn. I goes in again. Ooh, a great catch by Giles. Good D now goes in, passes to Harris. Harris going in, and the score by Harris. First timeout by NCCU. Let's look at the time and the score, folks. Four minutes and 19 more seconds. All right, NCCU ball now. Number seven, I goes in. I right, looking for oh, and okay. a, pa a great pass by I and number ten scene makes it. That was a great design by the head coach. Great Bravo. team play. Burns passing it to Rowe. Rowe with the three pointer and a miss. Still Radford ball. Walters trying to go in. Defense by Giles. Ran out, ooh, a great cut by number 10, Sin. Passes to I and passes it to number nine, a feint. Mbay with the ball now with the three-pointer. And a miss. Now for Radford University. You're starting to catch your own pace, but so is Radford. Good D for NCCU now. And a three-pointer. And a miss. Both sides doing great with their defense right after the timeout by NCCU. Row now with the ball. That's in a three-pointer by number 11 and a swish. What a shot by number 11, Burns. Number 10 going to, oh, seen pass it. Now to number nine. That's to 23, Z. And to May, oh. Bit of a rough play from Radford University. Call the foul. Entering the position, attacking the paint, kick it out to the corner, good to great to the 45, and attacking inside again, get to the free throw line. That was a great ball movement by NCCU. Now a free throw by Mbe. Definitely being the bread maker for the team right now. Sadly, not on that shot. 
Team showing support to him now. I got shooter, I got shooter. Makes a second one, and now Radford's offense. Goes in by himself, and a mess made with nice defense, used his height. Good D by that. Oh, and a nice cut by number two, Walter. That was Giles, my mistake. And Walters passes to Giles. Great defense by NCCU so far. Yep. And a shot. And an NCCU ball. Substitution by Radford University. Going on is number five, Harris. And number 25, Castleberry. Castlebear himself showed great plays yesterday. Looking forward to what kind of plays he does today. NCCU ball right now with number 10 seen. Looking for an open. Passes to May. And May makes a shot. That was very consistent, tough shot. And they got into 2-3 zone now. Tried to slow them down. Oh, a little miss on the catch by Harris, but the ball is still Radford. And a 10-pointer, a three-pointer. NCCU, great D, starting to catch up on the points. Six point ahead by Radford University. Might be shortened down after this, and Bay with the ball. Once again, once they attack the paint, good thing happens, so it was great. Everything started from the defensive rebound, fighting, boxing out, and pushing the ball, got into the drag screen, attacking the paint. Great to see them doing that. That's right, that's right. And just like you explained in the beginning of the game, Mbay and Havers is definitely having the crash right under the hoop. Absolutely, that's their strengths. First shot's missed. Coach Sue with a serious look towards his players. May makes a second shot. Pass to Turner. Turner to Walters. To Giles. Goes for the shot and a miss. Now with NCCU. I taking time to go into their side. Ball to Chow. High running in, and a pass. A great pass to Yi, number 21. Oh, and there it goes, the first quarter. That was a beautiful play. Um, now, so far, everybody has been, you know, doing the job and nobody specific. Uh, they are playing both uh, team basketball, so we'll see how it goes on the second quarter. Let's look forward to it. You can also tell the arena is starting to heat up as well. We're going to start off with Radford University with the ball, with the offense. Here we go. Walters going to Giles. Giles with a three-pointer and a miss. Still Radford ball. Turner looking for an open. Nice pass. And a nice shot. Going to Radford University. 21 Pierce. Great way to start the game. Showing their strengths and a finish with two points. That's great. A good pressure to NCCU. There goes Mbay with his turn. Sadly a miss. Now Walters going in for Radford University to Turner. 
And a three-pointer. Oh, but a nice catch by Pierce. The out of bounds, NCCU ball. Even though he missed the shot, that was great uh, sharing the ball and then wide open three. That was great offense by Rattford University. Very true, very true. Yeah, NCCU going now. Z passing it to. Now he passes it in Bay. There goes Bay with the shot, and he makes it. And wow, that was a swift shot. Now they like to stop after the make shot. Be active on the defense. Oh, and a nice pass. And point to Radford. Well organized offense, great passes. That's right, good play by Pierce and Turner. May with the ball, pass it to Z. Z goes in strong and a foul. Good play by Yi Han Su. It was great that he's using his body, attacking inside, get to the free throw line, so he knows his strengths and attacking it. I like it. You got to tell number 21, Yi is quite motivated after that nice shot right at the end of the first quarter. That was the first shot. He makes it. Second shot going. Makes it both. Way to go, Yi. Now yep. Radford ball. Picking up from the backcourt, putting some a little bit of pressure to slow them down. Now get into the zone defense. Radford University has to figure out how to attack the gap. And the Bay catches it. There goes I running in. Will he make it? Ooh, a big crash. And a foul. Number nine, Chow. Great play by himself. So we're going to have a replay. Mbe did a white, nice job getting the ball. Went for the shot, misses it, but gets the foul. Oh, but that was for the NCCU side now. Radford with the ball now. Giles with the ball going in. Oh, and there goes Harris and Bay. Flash of the Titans. And on that one, Harris gets the point. You can tell the arena is heated up now. A lot of strong chance going in. That was a great play. Screen for screen up play. Shot by number eight, Yoon. Now ties four. That's right, 25 25. Giles with a shot, and he makes it. Oh, we also got a foul here. Substitution by Radford. We have number 21 Pearson. And for the NCCU as well, we have Boob number 32. Boob is also a powerhouse. He got the big body. That's right. Let's see what the play is going to be like against Harris. Burns passing it to Turner. Going in with the two, and a miss. Both sides going after the ball, but NCCU gets it. They got into right into the offense. Paint attack. High drives in, couldn't make it. Goes out, passes to Chow. Oh, 
Shot clock is getting close. Nice catch by Turner. Passes it, oh! And there you go, NCCU sees the open and gets the score. Bradford ball now. Giles passing it to Turner. They had tried to overload and they had tried to attack 201 on 45 and corner, but NCCU did a great job. Did not allow oh. him to get out of the corner. That's a big shot. That's right, great three pointer. Shot clock right on the edge by Giles. All right, passing it to Mboop. Mboop goes in with it as a powerhouse. Gets the point for NCCU. It was a great pass by number seven, I. Once again, ducking in. Overload to the corner. Oh, and a miss by Turner. But Turner's still grabbing the ball. Oh! Huge crash is going on each side. Substitution now by Radford, number 13, Rowe is in. Timeout, first timeout by Radford University. Uh, for a moment now, I kind of saw Harris and Boop kind of going at each other. Both not very happy with each other's play, I guess. Yeah, uh, Raffle University, obviously the head coach doesn't, uh, she's not happy about how they attack the zone defense. And uh, on the other hand, NCCU, uh, they're doing decent job, you know, being active. And obtain the championship. And now both teams are back in the court. Now you can see NCCU fans are making some noise, showing love to their team, NCCU Griffins. Now the offense of NCCU now. Oh, they're looking for ducking and play. Beautifully done again. This is Japan, so you gotta say number seven, I was moving like a ninja. <laughs> Yeah, he was very fast, and that's because of the duck in that opened up the driving lane. Beautifully done. Now, Raptor ball. Walters passing it into Pierce. Pierce with a three pointer and a miss. Another try on the three pointer. Ooh, and a miss. NCCU ball now. A three-pointer now from NCCU. Sadly, both sides of the team could not make it. Oh, and the ball is out. It's NCCU. Burns was not happy with that one. Harris is back in the game now. Also number three, Giles is in as well. NCCU ball still. Great I'm going slip. in. Pass into number 21. Old Boop gets it. Still a good deep from Harris. Harris passes it to Rowe. Radford ball now. Giles passes it. Oh! Giles passes to Walters, but sadly Walters had a slip. Yeah. NCCU ball. Two position in a row. Finish with the uh, finish the offense with turnovers. Hack, head coach shouldn't be happy about it. Yeah, and finally now, NCC is leading with one point, and there goes I, and slick again like a ninja. Number seven, I say you, shining at this game. He won't show up on the stats, but that duck in definitely is an assist for the layup. Great pressure on the ball. And yet Giles goes in, my oh my, gets the point. That's a tough shot, they needed it. Both teams definitely shining right now. 32-33, NCC with one point lead. 
With almost three minutes to go on the second quarter, passes to number eight, Yoon, with a three-pointer. Oh, and a miss. Giles going in, and a foul by number seven, That's NCCU I. NCCU number seven, Yu Aiche. Pass, pass now. Team is second. Substitution now, number 10, Turner is in by Radford University. Obviously, defensive team, they try to stop the transition, but they have to go for the ball. Now it's a tie, 33-33. And Radford University gets the position afterwards. This might be the key moment here. There you go, and a lead for Radford University now, and it's their ball. Substitution by NCAA now. Number 10, Shin Hao Sang is in. Zhao seemed a little edgy on the first quarter now. And now starting to get his pace now. There goes Walters. The number 25, a three-pointer, and he makes it! What a shot by Castleberry. Great setup by Radford University. Screen for screen up play again. They got the wide open looks last time. Great communication by Radford University. Now he goes one on one. Got a three-pointer by number nine, and a miss. Mboob gets it, still NC's EU ball. Mboob going in strong against Harris, and he makes it! What a powerhouser! Well done, big fella. Use your strengths. Walters looking for an open passage to Giles. There goes Walters with a three-pointer. Ooh, and a miss. Boop catches it. Now it goes in number 10. Smooth play. Oh, and Radford University ball. Boop tries to get the ball. It slips it down, so it's Radford ball. Substitution by Radford University by number now it's number 20 on Pierce is in. And now timeout by NCCU. It has been very uh, good game, high intensity on both ends, both teams showing their strengths, loving it. Now as the assistant coach for the Diamond Dolphins, who would you like to recruit in this game? Um, there's a lot of eyes on th those teams, so they got to keep pushing themselves and we'll see how it goes. All right. And now for the Radford University ball now. Passing it to number 10, goes to Walters. Goes to Turner. Turner trying to bat to roll, but Turner goes for himself, and he makes it. A great shot, great play by number 10, Turner. Raffle University hasn't attacked the pain for a long time. Now they do. Good thing happens for them as well. So now get into the defense. More active. There goes Moop with the power play again. Oh, and a miss. Good defense by Radford now. A bit of a crash between number two and number nine. Oh, out of bounds, and the ball goes to NCCU. Based on the time, the guard wanted to make it clear they're looking for two for one, or they're looking for the one shot. Obviously, they didn't want to finish the position off of the turnovers. And now substitution, substitution from NCCU. NCCU. Number seven, I Che Yu is in. Now another. Sorry, NCCU have an opportunity to go for two for one, but we'll see how they manage to finish this quarter. With 40.2 seconds to go on the second quarter. Here we go.
Making sure to make plenty of time now. I uh, going and passing it. Moop with the ball now. Another power play with Moop and a foul. Good play by number 32, Moop. It's going to be interesting to see. Raffle University is going to adjust his post attack uh, in the second half, or they go straight one-on-one. Uh, -on -one. Obviously, he has been killing attacking the pain. And you can tell number five, Harris, is not liking it. And a miss on the free throw. And the first one. So about one more shot to go. 39-35, four-point lead by Radford University. Move with the second shot. And a miss. Radford now. Walters going in. Oh, a little too aggressive on the defense by well, number eight, Yun Shi Li of NCCU, Radford Ball, and a substitution now. Number one, Ben Chen Liao is in. Turner with the ball now. Passing it to Giles. Yeah, switch on the ball. Giles on the three-pointer. Oh, and a miss. A few seconds to go. You will make it. Oh! Now we're going to start on the third quarter now. Hamanaka-san, what is the thing that we ought to be looking at this game so far? On both teams, uh, what I like to see how they make an adjustment, how to attack the pain on offensive end. I like to see how they're going to do it from the both teams because once they attack the pain, good thing has been happening for both teams. So I like to see how they're going to manage that this uh, second half. That is true. Now the third quarter begins. At the beginning of the first quarter, Radford was going pretty well on it, but changing the tactics, NCCU is now very close with four points lead. Now Radford University true. goes right now with their with their first ball on the third quarter. Now they change the defense a little bit. Uh, one three one. Let's see if it works well with Radford University. Giles going in. Oh, a good D and a nice swat. And now NCCU ball now. Passage to number seven, I. Oh, and a nice bank goes in and a point for NCCU by number 10, Singh. Great patient, looking for the best shot they got. Attacking the paint, kick it out. Wonderfully done. Now defense will be more active. Hands all up, play big. Now Raffle wanna attack the paint, figure it out. Turner goes in with a shot, and there it goes. Point for Radford University. Now we'll see after the make how they're gonna turn up the uh, channel to on the defensive end. True on that. Scene took some time on passing back to himself and a three-pointer from Scene. Oh, and a miss. Rowe saves it. Now ball for Radford. Walters running in. Now they want to go quick before they settle the defense. And That's there a good goes Turner. <laughs> Turner. Good speed by Radford University. Not giving any time for NCCU to create their defense. Mm -hmm. And now number 23. With a three-pointer, oh, and a miss. Nice try on Z on that one. NCCU has been struggling making the shot behind Arc. And there goes Rowe with a three-pointer, number 13, Trevor Rowe. Great way to start the game. Uh, second half for Radford University. Now it's a nine-point lead for Radford University, 46, NCCU 37. And a three-pointer try by number zero. May, but sadly missed. Oh, 
Oh, and a nice D from NCCU. Gunning it in. Boom. One for NCCU. Shot by number 10, Steen. They definitely needed a point. And notice from the third quarter, they're all speeding up very, very fast. Yep. Walters now. Now the Turner. And a foul. It is so amazing with the big guys making the great bounce passes with the small area. That is amazing pass. Great play by number 21, Pierce, and now a substitution by Radford University. Number 11, Burns, is in. A great basket count play by... Pierce, now for a shot. He did a three-point play. What a great job. Now it's a 10-point lead for Radford University now. They definitely need the score right here. That's right for NCCU. Great activity by Radford University. Great ball movement, great rip through. Attacking by Mohammed, draw the foul. Mbay went strong with his play. Got a foul, but right before the shot, so no free throw. But still an NCCU ball now. Goes at number 10. Chow passing it to Mbay. Mbay goes in. A great pass. Oh, and a miss by Seen. But that was a wonderful teamwork by NCCU now. Great defense. He's tried to stop the ball That's by right. NCCU. Even at a miss, they went right back to their own side mm -hmm. with the defense. Oh, Turner goes in. And a pass to Harris. Harris misses it, but saves it. And a point to Radford. You do not want Harris to be open right under the hoop on this one. See now going on himself. And a foul was called. Great attack. Drawing the foul, get to the free throw line. Also, uh, some of the guys, they don't want to be in the foul trouble. So, great attack. Substitution now for Rafferty University. Castleberry's in. Getting the fouls are good, but this free throw is pretty much mandatory now to make sure to keep to have the ball in. There you go with the first shot. Way to go, number 10, Sing Hao Sung. Let's see if this becomes an eight-point lead, or still a nine-point lead. Now it's an eight-point lead. Good shot, good two shots now. Radford with ball now. Walters taking, taking a little time for the play. Turner with the ball now. Turner goes in strong. Oh, and a nice defense by NCCU. And speed play going in, but Radford was going back in too fast. Seen now with the ball. Oh, out of bounds. Against the zone, especially on the high post, they don't, he doesn't want to hold the ball too long. The hands are coming from everywhere, make a quick decision. NCCU did a great job, go aggressive on the ball. Now NCCU has a substitution, number 12, Sue is in. Mbay and Harris going at it. Mbay goes in strong. Oh, yeah, and he makes it. That was very smooth movement by him. Harris definitely looking a little afraid of getting the foul, which is a good tactic for NCCU side. Mm -hmm. Another. Oh, good job by another Walter. Another active hand again. And there goes number 12. Sue makes it. Now the lead is getting smaller and smaller. Radford 51, NCCU 45, six point lead for Radford. Hands are now coming from everywhere, so. 
Feeling the pressure, Radford University. And there goes a three-pointer by Burns and makes it. Great shot that was. Now NCCU, now I with the ball passing it to number 23. And a three-pointer from NCCU side. Bay gets it, good job on that one. Oh! And a foul. Mbay landed pretty strong on that one. Foul by number two, Walters. Substitution by Radford. Number 13, Rowe is in. Since uh, NCCU doesn't hit much of the threes today, crashing on board, keep the ball alive for the offense, and get to the free throw line, that's huge. Definitely, that was a great play. I like that he's an aggr uh, aggressiveness on board. And let's hope that play counts by making these free throws. Gets the first one. And gets the second one too. Great play by Mohamed Lamin Bey, number zero for NCCU. Now Radford University, they need to take care of the ball. That's right, now the two big houses are crashing in. Harrison Bay, oh, Harris going in strong, but wow, great defense by NCCU. A three-pointer by number 12, oh my, oh my, Sue makes a three-pointer. I believe NCCU is getting, grabbing their own pace back now. Huge, huge shot for them. And Rowe now with a three-pointer, and a miss. Bradford definitely starting to feel the pressure by NCCU. I with the two-pointer, and the pass to number 12. Another three-pointer by number 12. Bay, oh wow, what a swat by number 11, Burns. That was a very crowded area. Catch, just get up. He doesn't want to bring the ball down. Hands are everywhere from the guard. That's true, that's true. I gotta say though, uh, Burns is uh, SWAT right now. I can hear it all right now. You, can, you don't know who's gonna win this game yet, folks. Radford ball now. Giles taking time, calling out to his fellow team players, and a great pass to Harris. Oh, but Harris with a miss. May now going in. NCC goes. A nice pass. Oh, but a miss. Oh, we got a foul call on that one. Not a great defense. Defense against the dive straight up. No defensive foul, and then got into quick transition offense, finished with the no look passes. Loved how number seven, IJU, did a little face fake on that player just now. Head coach Su Wei Chen was very happy with their play just now. Was clapping with a smile to his uh, players. Another shot by May. Sadly missed the first one. It's the second one, though. Now it's a three point lead for Radford University. Now they'll be back in 2-3, but they got high, they got trapped on the ball. Now NCCU. Oh, and a travel by Harris. Defense. Now Raffle University want to make a run, so be a solid defense. There you go. Good D now. Oh, there goes Harris. Harris want to change his move. Goes for the dunk in the arena. Loves it. And for you folks who are watching this too, I hope you just enjoyed that one too. Great dunk by number five, Josiah Harris. Now NCCU ball. Number seven, I taking some time. Passing this to teammates. Number 12, back to I now. Goes in, 
by a play by number zero. Oh, good job made. Passing it to Rowe now. Turner. Oh, Harris now. Back home, man to man. Oh, and a shot by Burns. And a miss. Turner tries to get it. Oh, but NCCU ball now. Number seven, I goes with a three pointer by number 23. And a miss. Oh, out of bounds, but the ball is still NCCU. A uh, substitution by Radford University now. Number two, Walters is in now. Guess they want to use that speed on the defense with Radford. There goes a pass to number 21, a shot. Nice and clearly open, so number 20, Yi Han Tu makes it. Now it's only a point lead for Radford University, 56, 55, NCCU. Turner with a shot. Oh. NCCU's picking it up. Raffle doesn't want to give up the point here. They need a solid defense. May now with a shot. Oh, and a nice pass. Will they make it? Oh, yeah. And now NCCU's on the lead with one point now. What a game. Because he's making that jump shot from the free throw line. He gets all the tension that was great. nicely done, well done, looking for an open man. And you can hear NCCU fans making big noise on the defense. And it's an NCCU ball with 54.5 seconds to go in the third quarter. Radford University definitely feeling the pressure. Substitution by both sides. Right now, NCCU number 10, seeing how Sung is in now. Yi, who's been a big help for the third quarter, is in the back. Now, let's see if they can still go at it. Z with the ball now, pass it to I. Z with the three point. Oh, and a miss. Radford University ball. They set it up very beautiful. They're looking for the high post jump shot. If there's a tag from the behind of it, throw back three. Well organized. Walters looking for the open. Pass it to Giles. Giles with a shot. Oh! Great play by May. NCC on the offense now, with 15 seconds to go in the third quarter. Raffle got four fouls, so they don't want to foul either. A three-pointer now. Oh, and a miss. And there you go. NCCU 57, Radford 56. Radford was lead. Coming over to Japan outside the country and then showing some love to the uh, country's university. This is amazing. Yes. This is an amazing environment and an atmosphere in this gym. Hopefully they'll enjoy some Shibuya night after this as well. Absolutely. All right, now with the NCCU ball, starting the fourth quarter. Change of tactics on Raffer's defense now. Pass, pass it now, a two-pointer by number 12, and a miss. Oh, still the ball is alive for NCCU. And Bay with the ball now, oh, we have a foul there. Foul by number 21, Pierce. So he got the fourth foul, but Oh, we see a little injury on the NCCU side. Been a huge help for the team now. Hopefully the momentum isn't broken. Bay goes in. 
Goes up and get the ball for himself, but sadly misses. Radford ball now. Walters goes in. Pass it to Turner. Oh, and Turner slips up. Now it's an NCCU ball. So a little aggression by number 10, Seen. Substitution just happened for Radford. Number five, Harris is in. Still a point lead for NCCU, 57-56. Two goes in, passing it to May. May goes in. Radford not letting them score that easily. Now the offense of Radford, Giles goes in. Oh, good DNCCU. High passes to number 10. Oh, and a three pointer. Oh, wanted that one. And we see a foul now. Radford University ball now. Gotta say, both teams are very strong with the defense on the fourth quarter now. And now NCCU puts in Boop now. NCCU is back on zone defense. Number 11 with the three-pointer and makes it. Great shot by number 11, Burns. Nicely done, even in the first half, uh, first half, they draw this play one time. Still can't see who's gonna win on this game. Notice some of the kids at the arena are really excited watching this game. Yeah. Just a little boy jumping around, looking at the game. Which is nice. Hopefully that kid is going to be a future pro basketball player. Absolutely, absolutely. All right, now with the NCCU ball. Now again, ducking in. All right, going in, passing it to number 10. And makes a good shot by Sin. Burns with the ball, passes to Walters. Walters looking for a place. There goes Turner. Back to Walters. To Burns, Burns goes in. Oh, a good D by NCCU. NCCU very aggressive to get the ball. A little crash on each other. A three-pointer by number 12, and makes it switch. Great shot by two. Hi, number seven from NCCU, creating all the play for his teammates. He has been having a great vision on the floor. Definitely shining at this game. Oh, and a good open by Harris, but a miss. Great attack by uh, number two, attacking the paint, but also once the middle guy comes up, he goes underneath, get to the free throw line. Great offense by Raffle University as well. Harris now with a free throw, sadly miss. Harris must feel the pressure because he's been fouling a lot now. Definitely want to stay in the game as well. Second free throw coming up. Second shot and a miss. Boop, catching the ball. Radford being aggressive, trying to get the ball, but NCC is on the offense. Number 10 goes in on himself and a miss, but Boop saves it. Crashes up against the. Turner with the foul for Radford now. 
This move went down soon and like he was in a bit of pain. Two free throws now. Goes to the first one. Ooh, and a miss. Only six minutes and 59 seconds to go now. With a three point lead by NCCU. Makes it, which makes it a four point lead now. Radford definitely want to pick up the pace. Turner with a two pointer. Oh, and a miss. NCC at the offense now. High with the ball now. Oh, we get a foul. Ball handler needed to wait until the, his teammates setting a solid screen. They got into each other, moves too fast. That causes the offensive foul. You can tell that number two, Walters, is getting a little upset with the game. Got to keep the cool and keep on going with their own pace now. Dallas Pounds to make Walters, a three-pointer by Walters. Oh, and a miss, but Harris gets it. But NCC with the defense catches it. Oh, both teams going after the ball. And the ball goes to Radford University. Shot clock is eight seconds to go now. Four points ahead, NCCU. Giles going strong, and he makes it. That is a tough shot. Let's see if that helps the momentum for Radford University. Yep, they definitely turned the things up from the defensive up, defensive end. Try to speed up a little bit on the game, uh, game tempo. Now they switch on the ball, small guy on the big guy. Oh, a nice move at the end, gets a point for NCCU number 10, Singh. Giles doing a lot of things, but oh, goes in himself. But a great D by NCCU now. Number 10 goes in again. All in zone. What a play. What a shot by number 10. Scene. Beautiful shot. Now it's a six point lead by NCCU. And a defense. Turner misses the shot now. NCCU now. Now they need to stop the ball. Now uh, NCCU pushing the ball, tried to keep the pace up. That's right, they definitely got their groove going on right now. Still calm, taking time. Seen going in again by himself. Oh, and a miss. Foul. Foul by number two, Walters. Time out by Rad. Players are in the court now. NCC is still taking a little bit of time. And here they come. Now NCCU got two free throws right now. By right, number 10, Sing Hao Sun. Definitely hyping the, heightened the momentum to the players with his wonderful shot. Just stood back like a minute ago. Sadly misses the first shot. Oh, and a miss. Now Radford ball. That's a huge uh, point. 
moment for Raffler missing two. That's right, that must have hurt on that one for NCCU. Giles giving a, giving a couple of feints. Now passing it to Walters. Walters to Giles. Giles with the three-pointer. Oh, and a miss. NCCU now. Boop, great pass to number seven, I. Mbay now with the ball. Has it seen again? Oh, foul. And a basket count. What is going on? Number 10 seen. The man is on fire. Because of the switches and they're having a communication for second. Defense was le uh, late for second. And he turned the corner sharp. That was a great finish by him. Just heard a little boy yelling out kakui, which means that is so cool in Japanese. Glad to see the kid, kids are enjoying in this game as well. Great play by Scene. A shot was made. Now Radford. Now uh, let's check out the point. Nine point lead by NCCU 70. Radford 61. Turner going in now and a foul by number 12 for NCCU 2. Good play by number 10, Turner now. If they didn't hold the ball above their head and, you know, consider they're looking for the pass or shoot, just quick attack, 0.5, good thing hap happens for Radford. So they got to keep doing it the rest of the game. But both teams now with four fouls now. Might be a festival of free throws after this. We'll see what's going to happen. Turn a great job making both shots now. Less than four minutes to go in the fourth quarter. Seven point lead on NCCU. Oh, and that's by my May. Great bounce pass in the small area. And great finish. Walter goes in, passes to Harris, but oh, there's a foul call. Foul by NCCU number seven, I. Definitely want to make these shots by Walters. First one, oh, that's a pressure for Radford University. Another shot. Definitely want to take this one and swish. Substitution by NCCU. Number 23, Z is back in the game. Went to the back once, but glad to see he's back in the game now. Obviously, both teams want to go aggressive on the defensive end, but they don't want to foul. That's going to have three opportunity for the free throws. And there was number 10, C. Oh, oh, it makes it! Now he's making everything. Now it's a 10-point lead for NCCU with almost three minutes to go. My, oh, my, NCCU's on fire. Walter drives in, passes it to Giles. Giles with the three-point and makes it! That's a huge one. That's a definitely a big one now. They didn't want to over help from the ball side. C now goes in, goes in again. But May catches it. Oh! A nice D by Harris. It's still an NCCU ball. Although Mbe wasn't happy with that call there, though. Asking the referee that was a foul. Good eye on the referee. Sell an NCCU ball. Eye driving in. Passes to May. There he goes. Oh! And a crash. And Mbe's went down pretty bad, but he's back up. That foul was going to Harris. 
for Radford. MCCU two shot. On the pick and roll, small guy took the diver who is a taller guy and strong and coach has been telling the guy on the big guy on the corner they have to rotate three man switches. Oh, but you got to make this free throw right now. Second shot now. I got shooter. And they makes it. Eight point lead by NCCU. Less than two and a half minutes to go. In the fourth quarter, a great pass by Giles. Now Harris misses it. Oh no, Harris is not happy about that. Great wall up, straight up. Both hands are straight up. Make the shot difficult. Executing a defensive rebound, nicely done. A oh, good favor in Bay. Pass to the seat. And a nice shot by Z now. Less than two minutes to go in the fourth quarter. NCCU has their groove going on. Turner goes in. And shoots. And a miss. Turner still got the ball. Oh, no, but May catches it. Passes it. There goes Z. Oh! A little too aggressive by Giles. Got to say, Hamanaka's on number 10 scene is definitely the mood maker on the fourth quarter for NCCU. Absolutely, and also as a group, he has been very smart. Once he's on hot, the guys has been giving him a ball and then putting him in, put him in a good situation with the great uh, alignment. And a great shot. One more to go. Great job being on the same page, how to attack with the pick and roll by NCCU. Now they want to push the ball, looking for the quick shot. Harris with the ball now, and he makes it. They don't want to go back down, they need to put the pressure. NCCU going in now. Passes to I. I just see. Goes in strong by the three pointer now. Oh, and a miss. This is important. Cannot make this miss anymore. I having the ball now. Oh, a little too aggressive play by number three, Giles. Losing team definitely need a time, so either they go foul game right away or they're gonna go super aggressive looking for a uh, trap and looking for the steal. NCCU definitely doesn't want to rush the shot. They want to take time and ideally get to the free throw line. But Rafa want to go trap, trap, trap and keep the pace up. We'll see. NCCU 78, Radford 69, a nine point lead by NCCU with two free throws now by number seven, Aichiyu. Makes a shot, makes it a 10 point lead now. Let's see if it becomes an 11 lead point. Raffer still having a chance. They need a quick shot. 11 burns now, pass to Row Row with a three-pointer. Ooh, and a miss. NCCU gets the ball. NCCU trying to take some time, pass it to number 12. Still, still going strong, number 23. Goes number 12, back to number seven, I. Oh, Giles gets the ball with a three-pointer. Ooh, that's gotta hurt, but still the ball's alive for Radford. Burns with a three-pointer. 
Ah, and a miss. But it's so bad for Bull with 19.8 seconds to go. NCCU doesn't want to turn the ball over. They want to hold the ball, wait. The defense is coming. But Raffle has been doing a great job, being active. The steal, pushing the ball, keep the pace up. Now substitution by NCCU. Number 12, Tsu goes in. Let's see how well of a defense NCCU can do it. And let's see how great an offense Raffer can do. And a three-pointer by Giles. And he makes it and swish. Now they're going to look for the steal now. Got to go aggressive. Right Got to go aggressive. Oh, Giles it. gets it. Pass to Walters. Now to Turner. And Dang makes it. it. What a shot. My goodness. Now it's a four-point lead only by NCCU. We can... Giles now talking up with his players. Now NCCU is back in the court now. Now NCCU out advancing the ball. As somebody catches the ball, they're gonna come trap and foul. That's right. Six point zero seconds to go. Let's see how wonderful the semifinals go with NCCU and Radford. Harrison trying to see it. Oh, and Giles catches the ball. Goes for a three-pointer. Oh, Harris now and misses. Oh, my goodness. But i got to say, the not ever give up spirit of Radford University was beautiful. But the victory goes to NCCU 79, Radford University 75.